Welcome back to MFM. Today, we have this. I'll show you. So this is uh, our cat. He was absolutely desperate for attention and a bath. So he would not stop crying. Isn't that right? Because you want pets. That's what you want all the time. And now he's happy. So he's going to be here for a little while while we do our unboxing. And no, this is not an unboxing channel. But I'll do one every once in a while when I get something that I really like or is decently cool or vitally informative. I don't know. Whatever. Anyways, this is what I got. What's this, Spidey? It's backwards. That's where it is. As you can see, he's not impressed one bit. Um, but yeah, this is the uh, Victron Energy Solar Charge Controller. Uh, it's the MPPT120. Uh, the Bluetooth model, so I'll be able to keep track of what's going on with the battery, the solar panel, and the charge controller to see what the energy consumption I have and the battery state and all this other stuff, uh, which is really nice because I was just going to add a bunch of that anyway into the truck, but this kind of take care takes care of all of it, and um, yeah, it's really nice. It's really simple, straightforward, and... Um, they say they have a five-year warranty, and they've been around for a while, so that's pretty cool. So I'm going to open it and see what the heck is inside here. So here's the manual. It's pretty nice. It's only 10 pages long. The writing is a little small, but there's a couple different little graphs and stuff on here. Pretty simple. Straightforward. Anyways, who wants to hear about a manual anyway? So how do we open this? Am I interrupting you? Yes. So this is it. It's about, I don't know, probably two and a half inches thick by about five wide, probably almost six with the, the aluminum fins here. These are for cooling and air ventilation and all that. And uh, here's where you connect your battery. Uh, I'm going to be running mine in series. I'm running a 12 volt system and then this is the solar panels so that it modulates how much flow goes from the solar panel to the battery and then the load I have an inverter it's like a 2000 watt inverter and that is going to be obviously attached to here because this tells everything what to do. This is a computer. This is a little computer. Um, yeah. I like it. It's nice. It has a little fuse box or a little fuse right here integrated in there. And uh, I don't know what this pin is, but I'm not going to mess with it until I read the directions. And whenever you buy special equipment like this, read the directions. Don't just read the warning on the side and, you know, look at it and say, oh, yeah, you know, there's the information I need. Like, there's a little bit more in the manual, especially since this is a Bluetooth. Uh, charge controller. I'm gonna go read that. I'm gonna check it out. This is going in my El Camino because yes, I'm putting a solar panel on top of the shell that I've been working on. If you haven't checked that out yet, I'll link it up 
Can I say which way? Can you face this way? Watch in this way. I think it'll be here. I think it'll be up there somewhere. Anyways, pretty cool. I've been waiting a long time to get one of these. Uh, with this, I'll be able to go all the way up to, I think it's 280 watt system. Maybe 300 watt. I'm not 100% sure. I'd have to check the calculations again. Um, but yeah, that's enough to run like a little mini fridge on cycling and, you know, charge your phone. I actually have a TV in the El Camino that I um, was able to mount in a very fun way. I'll have to show you that in a later video too. Uh, and then I also have to figure out how to link that to a... We'll talk about the TV. I gotta figure out how to link that to a speaker system in the back. And I'm also planning on building a, like a drawer system in between the wheel wells so that I can pull two drawers out and have a full storage system in there. Because last time I went camping, it was kind of a nightmare to just have everything thrown in the back. And I'd much rather be organized. I like being organized. And uh, this is uh, another step in the right direction. So I will see you next time. This is your midweek update. Thank you for tuning in to MFM. And I will see you next time. Isn't that right, Spidey? <laughs> He's just going at it. I'll see you later.